Hathbar, written by Frankie de Tory. Number two, Hasbar, Richard Hills. Number three, Heart of Joy, Walter Swinburne. Four in the groove, Steve Cawthon. Number five, uh, Sally Rouse, written by Gary Carter. And number six is Waterwell, the Mount of Michael Roberts, who won the first at Warwick. So those are the six runners. And this is how they bet. Heart of Joy, the six to five on favourite from 11 to 10 on. Hasbar steady at four to one. And Al Wathba is 11 to two from fives. In the group, also 11 to 2 from 5 to 1. Sally Rouse at 14s. And Waterwell, the extreme outsider, 100 to 1. All quoted for the Nell Gwyn stay. Seven furlongs the trip. The six runners line up and they break away. And uh, Wathbur and the Yellow Jacket a little bit slowly away as they come to the first furlong. And it's Hasbar setting the pace, which doesn't seem to be that strong. With Heart of Joy on the outside of In the Groove. And in behind these comes Sally Rouse. And these are followed uh, by Waterwell, who's last of all. And Wathbur last, but one on the outside. But it's Hasbar leading as they continue their journey through the first quarter mile. Hasbar in blue in the groove and Heart of Joy second and third. Wide are Wathba, then Sally Rouse and Waterwell just the back marker. The tempo is quickening now as they come down towards halfway and in the groove strode particularly well down to the start. He's on the outside of Hasbar. That's a fully in the blue jacket Richard Hills. In behind these Heart of Joy, the favourite, well placed. Al Wathba's making ground on the outside of Sally Rouse. Waterwell, the rank outsider, is last. They pass the bushes, just over two to go, and there's still quite a lot of all to play for. Hasbar has it from in the groove, and in behind them, Heart of Joy is uh, going to have to commit now. Uh, on the outside, Sally Rouse is coming with a run, and Hasbar is keeping up the momentum, and Heart of Joy is having to struggle. Sally Rouse is coming on the outside of in the groove. We could be in for a shock here, at least. Those who have backed Heart of Joy, but now she's starting to go. It's Hasbar who still has it, but Heart of Joy puts in a big finish. A three-way photo in the Nell Gwynn, one for the judge. Hasbar, Heart of Joy, in the groove, you name it. Very, very close indeed. And it wasn't until the last 50 yards, really, that Heart of Joy started to uh, make ground. She's in the middle. On the far side is Hasbar, and nearest to us is in the groove, and that is very close. Look at those shadows uh, on, the, on the grass. The very faintest strip running across the centre of the picture there uh, from the winning line. It gives the, an indication as to how um, and where the winning line is. But the shadows, well, that's very, very close indeed. And it'll be very interesting indeed to see how they bet in the ring on the outcome of this Nell Gwynn Stakes. Bar is third at nine to two. The distance is a short head and a short head.